Shalom, Akim, giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah Bashem, Rakak Kodash, double honor to the apostles and the elders, great millstone, salutations to sincere Akim out there of the hopeful elect. All right. Um, give a shout out to the brother Barack Abar. You know, he sent me he sent me the text of the new video on um on the No Jumper podcast, which is Adam 22's YouTube channel. Adam 22 is the so-called white boy, the Edomite that you see there in the picture. All right, but this this uh this video is featuring WAC 100, Tariq Nasheed, and Captain Tazayak of the ISUPK. All right, now I'm not going to dissect the interview. I'm not going to dissect Captain Tazayak on this one, you know. But it's this typical same old shit that he's been doing, jumping on different podcasts like a whole ass nigga, right? Clout chasing, seeking fame and glory, you know. Denying the name of the Lord because 30 minutes, I didn't see the whole video now, but 30 minutes on in, had enough time to introduce, you know, the, 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 the followers on that channel to the Most High and His Son by, by glorifying His names, Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai, okay, which you didn't do, all right, because you damn sure mentioned General Yahana, okay, in the ISGBK and gave like a little brief history that the ISGBK is from the, you know, the original. The original one West school with the year the school was established in 1969. Well, listen, you ain't never mentioned um the name of the Mosai and his son, Yahweh, Yahweh Shah. All right. So it's clear that the Mosai, it just indicates that the Mosai ain't dealing with you. Okay. If the Lord was dealing with you, then you would definitely glorify his name. You would praise and honor his name. Right. General Yohanna is dealing with you. That's why. You gave uh, credence unto General Yohanna, okay? Because General Yohanna is dealing with you, and he's a low-life nigga, all right? But the Lord is clearly not dealing with you, or else you would have said their names, okay? Now, I didn't watch the whole video. I don't know if you said the names later on down the line, but, uh, you know, Jake got a short attention span, man. A lot of people ain't going to sit there and watch the whole damn show of No Jumper podcast or whatever, Adam 22's podcast. Right? So you supposed to, that's the first things you supposed to do is glorify Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. When, whenever you, um, uh, whenever you are so called in the spirit and teaching our people, you got to give credit the way credit is due. And you wouldn't have none of this knowledge had it, had, had it not been for the Most High and His Son. Okay? So the Lord just ain't dealing with you, man. And I ain't mad at that. And like I said, man, I'm not going to dissect the interview. I only seen a half hour of it. And from what I've seen so far, it said it, 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 it pretty much shows me the direction that the whole damn thing was going to go. Okay. It's the typical civil rights bullshit that he's been on lately when he jumps on these podcasts, man. You know, you know what black people need to do, you know, it, 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 black people's problems. Same shit Martin Luther King and Malcolm X was kicking when they used to uh, get on those, uh, those mainstream media outlets and do, and do interviews, man. Okay, same typical bullshit. All right, so that nigga is just a civil rights activist leaning on Israel. That's all he is, man. You know, you go sit there and wear the, the, the garments and you know and 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 and, and look and you know and, and portray the image of being an Israelite warrior with the door knocker jewelry and the apparel on and all of that, man. Okay, that shit don't mean nothing, man. All right, if the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh shining with you. And it's clearly not with you, Captain Tazariak of the ISUPK. All right. But um, you know, since you niggas want fame so much, I'm talking about all you clowns, man, that jump on these all these different podcasts. By the way, Adam 22 is an Edomite. That's another thing, man. The guy is a goddamn Edomite, man. Okay? And you trying to get fame and glory from a from what being on an Edomite's podcast? You know? And the Lord said he's gonna give us fame, man. All right. And that's not the first thing you should be seeking is to be glorified and to become famous. But the fame that the Lord is going to give us is not the typical type of fame that what you niggas are thinking of about, man, what the average nigga think about when it comes to what being famous actually is. OK, because the only fame that the so-called white man can give you is a little bit of fucking money and some exposure in the media. All right. That's the only fame that the so-called white man can give you. That's that's the, the clout chasing shit. That a lot of these Israelites are doing out there, man. Okay? All right? The fame that we're going to receive through the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is that the nations are going to fucking fear us, man. 
okay? They're going to fear us because they're going to see that the Lord is dealing with us, man. All right? Okay? And when it comes among Israel, the Lord has it where we, we get the power to um to heal certain people, which we are, okay? That fame is going to spread abroad too, man. You know, the, you know the, the Lord using certain brothers as a vessel to heal people in, in, in our own... Um, of our nation that are actually messed up, man. You know, you got a lot of brothers that got ailments. You got brothers that are crippled, right? You got believers that are that are, that are um blind. You had a blind man come up to the camp one time, man. You know, you know. I'm, I'm sorry. I think I believe he was um he was mute. He couldn't really speak. Okay. You know, you did have a, a brother one time that was blind. He came up came up to the camp, man. I remember that. Okay. All right. And he, you know, he just, he wanted to hear the word, man. Okay. So brothers like that are going to be healed. They're going to be healed. And who, how's the Lord going to heal them? He's going to use his servants, his men, when he gives us the power. Okay. But the ultimate fame that we're going to receive throughout the world is what? When the Lord gives us the spiritual power to, to, to put, to put terror in, in the hearts of these other nations, man. Put, put the, put dread, the dread of us. Through Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is going to be instilled in these nations, man, when the Lord gives us power. That's the kind of fame and glory we're going to receive through Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. All right? Not from slam dunking a ball in a fucking hoop. All right? Or launching a football across the field, man. That's not that's not the fame we're going to get, man. Okay? All these goddamn man dingo fights in a, in, a, in a fucking ring. All these boxing matches. All this shit is all rigged anyway, man. Okay, or some goddamn Dominican hitting a ball with a stick out of the goddamn baseball field, man. All right, that, that's not the fame that we're looking for, man. You know, the fame that you, you niggas are looking for is 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 is, 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 is it's all obtained through evil acts, man. Look at the music industry, man. How these niggas are selling their soul, selling themselves out, man. You know, to to promote poison to our people, man. Into the minds of the youth, right? Okay, matter of fact, let me get, this is Psalms, the book of Psalms, chapter 110, verse 3. It says, Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power. All right? Thy people. Who are, who's the Lord's people? The Israelites. You so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. And the Lord said, thou, It says, Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power. Meaning what? You people are going to become humble, man, when the Lord starts to, 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 to manifest his power through us. Through his believers, through his elect. Okay? Alright? All of that scoffing and talking shit and slandering us and trying to um, mock us and, and sh uh, uh, sh shame us. Okay? You're going, you, a lot of you people, you're going to be humiliated, man. When Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahweh Shah gives us power. Okay? Because you mother effers didn't believe, man. You didn't believe in the Lord. Alright? It says, thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power. So that's how the Lord is going to uh, give us praise and fame in, in this society. Okay. When he, it, when he, you know, channels his spirit through us to, to, uh, to, to make miracles go about among the people. All right. M miraculous ways of healing people and also miraculous ways of killing people, putting people to death, man. You know. The Lord is going to be with us and the people are going to be humbled, man, when they see that, when they see that actually takes place, man. OK. Uh, this is the book of Zephaniah, chapter three, verse 17. The Lord, thy, the Lord, thy power in the midst of thee is mighty. Yes. Yahweh Ba Shem Yahweh Shah. All right. Who's the, who's the creator of everything that exists to this day? It says he will save. He will rejoice over thee with joy. He will rest in his love. He will joy over thee with singing. All right. So the Lord is going to deliver his elect, man. And there's going to be so much shit going on during the time of Jacob's trouble, man. You know, it's going to be clear who the Lord is dealing with when you see the, 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 the men who are prospering through all of this, man, and not falling victim to Satan's uh, madness. OK, because a lot of you people are going to be fucked up, man. You know, a lot of you are going to die from starvation because because of the famine. All right. It's going to be a famine introduced. To this world, a lot of you gonna be carted off in cargo, in um, <laughs> cargo slave ships, and in in, <laughs> in um, concentration camps. It's, it's slip up of the tongue, okay? 
And you're going to be tortured in the concentration camps, man. All right? You know? You see what's going on in America. I was saying, I did a video about America being played out and all these stores shutting down. You got abandoned shopping malls in, in America, man. Which is basically prime candidate retail for a fucking concentration camp, man. Okay? So a lot of you jakes is going to be in, in, a, in, a, in a terrible predicament, man. Once this devil reveals his horns, and if the Lord ain't dealing with you, all right, the Lord ain't dealing with you, if you're not glorifying the names of Yahweh Bash and Yahweh Shah, right, that means the Lord ain't really, he's not really dealing with you, man, okay, then you're going to fall victim to all of that shit, man, but the believers, the brothers who's doing the work, as long as they endure until the end, then those are the ones who's going to get saved from all this bullshit, man, you know? Dodging and curbing them concentration camps, eating through a famine. Okay? But when militias and troops come out at, at us, we're gonna escape. Right? We might have to confront some a lot of them guys and kill some of them mother effers, man. Okay? But the Lord is gonna see us through all of that bullshit. That's why he said he's gonna save us, man. Alright? It says, I will gather them that are sorrowful for the solemn assembly. Alright? And how's the Lord gonna gather us, man? All right, the Lord is gathering us right now through the Spirit, okay, by waking brothers up. Brothers are woken up. But the ultimate gathering or assembly is going to be when the Lord beams us up into them chariots, man. All right, okay, I will gather them that are sorrowful because we are sorrowful, man. You know, brothers back here have repented, man. Once we woken up to the fact that we're Israelites and learned the Lord's statutes and commandments, okay, we repented from doing them fucking evil things, man. You know? And a lot of times when you reflect on this certain shit that you used to do in the week, like, damn, I can't believe I used to do that, man. I used to eat shrimp. I used to eat pork. All right? You know? And you, it, it becomes a disgust because your spirit it, your spirit has changed, man. So we are the ones who are sorrowful, man. Okay? The elect is sorrow. Is sorry. It says, I will gather them that are sorrowful for the solemn assembly. Right? Solemn meaning something that's serious, man. To be accounted for as 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 as, uh, as something very serious, man. You know, you know, and that's gonna be a serious ordeal when America's uh, destroyed, and the Lord has to assemble us and gather us up into them chariots, man. Okay, it says, "Who are of thee to whom the reproach of it was a burden?" Okay, yeah, man, we all we been catching hell in this society, man. All right, more so the brothers who have been um. Doing the work of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Okay? Alright? It's like a double whammy for us because, hey, we already Israelites and Israelites fall under these curses. Okay? So we we are part of that nation that has fell under them curses. But more so, being that we represent or are ambassadors of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah unto the people, we get flack from our own people, man. Okay? Alright? From the whole goddamn world, man. We're in People of our own nation are even against us, man. Okay? You know, they call us dead beasts. They call us rapists. They call us all kind of shit, man. Bums. Everything, man. You know? Why? Because they don't believe in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah and the Lord ain't dealing with them, man. All right? It reads on to say, Behold, at that time I will undo all that afflict thee, and I will save her that halted, I will save her that halted, and gather her that was driven out. And I will get them praise and fame in every land where they have been put to shame. Okay? So the Lord is going to make us famous, man. He's going to give us praise and, 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 and get, get, get us famous. Make us famous. Okay? Among the people. All right? All of that is going to be done by Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. Because the world is going to see that the Lord is dealing with us. All right? So the fame that, that, that you niggas are chasing the that you niggas are hunting down the so-called white man for and, you know, blowing his rod and, you know, and, and, and brown nosing him and doing all kind of shit, shuffling the job and dancing for him and all of that, you know, for some Federal Reserve notes and some media exposure. Hey, that's that, that fame, that that's that's tainted fame, man. That's really that becomes you motherfuckers going to become infamous in all reality, man, because the so-called white man is the devil. The so-called white man is the devil, okay? And that kind of fame can't compare to the fame that the Lord is going to give us. 
Because the fame that we're going to have is power, man. Power. All right? Being resurrected as a people. Okay? Because everybody looked at us like we fucking deadbeats. Like we ain't nobody, man. Like we, like everything that we saying is a lie. Because you don't believe and it's impossible and it'll only take a miracle. And you damn right. And we tell you it's going to take a miracle. Right? But is, was it not Yahweh Shah a performer of miracles when he was on the scene 2,000 years ago? Okay? So miraculously, through the spirit of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah, he's going to raise us up. And he's going to give us praise and fame, as it tells you in the scriptures. And it says, in every land where they have been put to shame. And you people have certainly mocked us, right? Scoffed at us and put us to shame. Accused us of all kind of shit that we didn't even do, man. Right? And, it, 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 and you don't even know us from a hole in the wall, man. So it couldn't have been nothing personal. It was more so because, you, you know, spiritually, you can see that the Lord is actually dealing with us, man. You say, damn, them guys, they... they all the shit that they say, they and, 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 we, and, and them guys can't be confounded, and they still out there, man. We can't get these guys to stay the fuck home and stop putting videos up and, and not go out there on the streets and teach in the name of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah. All right? So you guys got an issue with the Lord, man, because you don't know us personally. Okay? But it's all good, man. Hey, the Lord said he's going he's to give us fame, man, and praises. In that day, and you going, and you people going to see it, man. All right, you know. Um, I was going to read Matthew sixteen and twenty four, but I think I'm a. Yeah, I think I think the point is pretty much made, man. I think the point is pretty much made. All right, you know, you got Tazariak on Adam Twenty Two's channel, no jumper, you know, hanging out with the likes of of uh Whack One Hundred, all right, who's a fucking simple minded ex gang banger. Still game member, nigga can't make up his mind whether he's gang, Pyru, or ex banger. All right, what a simple nigga like that, man. Okay, but this dude is no, this dude is known for jumping on different platforms, man. All right, the Lord said, just go out there and teach, man. Go teach the word. Okay, that's all you've got to do. You got a video camera, USB cord connected to your computer, fucking upload videos of you teaching, man. That's it. That's it. If you're really sincere about worshiping Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, you know he said the majority of our people ain't gonna make it, man. So this thing is all about gathering fruit, not being the best debater, the best speaker, the best orator. Okay? It's all about gathering the fruit, right? G gathering the fruit, help helping the elect wake up, playing your part as a believer in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Okay? All right? And even if you don't gather any fruit, man, at the end of the day, your, 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 your faith has been manifested because what? You went out there. You went out there and you taught, man. All right? And, and, and you believed in Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah. That alone right there is going to give you fame and glory. All right? From the Most High unto the people, man. Okay? So I'm going to end this video on that note. I'm going to say Shalom. Wa Barakam to you, brothers. Lord, and I'll see you in the next one. Shalom.